Starting 2024, Steam will no longer support Windows versions before 10. At the meantime, Half-Life 25th Anniversary updates also produce binaries that are not compatible with Windows XP. But when you was forced to run Valve games on a 20-year-old gear, how did you cope with it? This video is a tutorial on how to run Valve games and old Steam on Windows XP in 2024. You have to prepare an 7-zip archive and a Windows update program. The archive contains Steam program files snapshot at January 2019 from Internet Archive. The small update refreshes root certificates till April 2016 in Trust Store, which is necessary for communications with Steam API servers. After installing the update, you can run Steam from the extracted contents. Due to hierarchical changes in Steam content servers, you cannot download any games for real, which is a bad news. The only workaround is to copy Steam library files from your other PCs. It is worth mentioning that you need to roll back many Valve games to legacy version that is the last release before 25th anniversary. For Half-Life, Counter-Strike, Condition Zero, the identifier is Steam underscore legacy. For Half-Life 2, it becomes previous. Copy the library files and enjoy your games. Wicked sick. Wicked sick. Perfect. Coded message. Command and communication. Thanks for watching and cheerio for now.